Good morning, Harding Middle School. I'm Ellie. It's Monday, May 24th, 2021. It's National Scavenger Hunt Day. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. Here are the Harding headlines. Rangerettes and flag team, football, vaccines, and LRC books. Attention 6th and 7th grade dancers. Are you interested in seeing what it's like to be part of the Lakewood Ranger marching band as a flag or rangerette? We'll be holding a week-long camp this summer from July 26th through the 30th, where you can do just that. Sign up today. Registration is through the Recreation Department. See you there. Attention football players. Those interested in playing middle school football or freshman football next fall, Coach Thome will be at lunch this Thursday, May 27th, with paperwork and the summer calendar. Go Rangers! Attention all students ages 12 and up. Do not forget that you are eligible to receive the COVID-19 vaccine and you should get it, especially if your doctor recommends it. Vaccines are safe and effective. Do not listen to lies about vaccines spread by people who are not doctors or scientists. It's smart to get the vaccine, so be smart and ask your folks at home about how to get it. It will protect your health and this is the only way the disease will go away. Attention all students, please continue to return all library books to the library. Please check with Mrs. K. Hill if you are concerned about a book on your account. Remember that you will be charged for any books on your account that are not returned. The library wants the books, not your money, so just turn in the books. Here's a look at today's walk home weather with Nathan in our Ryder Crone Weather Center. Have you got the vaccine yet? Uh, not yet. Today's walk home weather will be 69 degrees Fahrenheit. Nice. That's 21 degrees Celsius. Fun fact, the pound symbol isn't officially called hashtag or pound. Its technical name is Octothorpe. The octo means eight to refer to its points, although nobody knows it was where the last part, Thorpe, came from. Some claim it was named after Olympian Jim Thorpe, while others say it's just a nonsense suffix. What do you think? I'm not sure. I've never been good with vocabulary. Now let's kick it over to Lana for On This Day in History. Take it away, Lana. Salutations, Warren G. Harding Education Center. On this day in history, in 1883, the Brooklyn Bridge opens. This is important because not only has the Brooklyn Bridge been featured in shows, movies, and is genuinely one of the most known bridges in America, it created the connection between New York City and Brooklyn, creating Greater New York. Back to the anchor. Let's take a look at today's lunch. Whole grain chicken chunks, broccoli cuts, mandarin oranges, whole grain roll, and of course, milk. Now here's Cece in our last Center 3000. This better be funny, Cece. Oh, don't worry. I'm the funniest person in the world. Hello, Harding. Today's new slapper is a lady at the bank asked me to check her balance. So I pushed her over. I guess her balance wasn't that good. Now that's a real new slapper. Back to the anchor. Remember to mask up and stay distanced. We're all in this together, Harding. This concludes your morning announcements, Rangers. Make it a great day of learning and friendship.